Okay, this is a general reading for uh, the sign of Aquarius for April 2015. And I really want to go ahead and get started. During the pre-shuffling, I was getting some very strong messages that's, that some of you um, possibly, and it may, I feel like it's going on now and it's going to be continuing through April possibly for some of you, I feel are very angry very, very angry. Um, I just feel like when I was shuffling the cards, anger was coming out, um, just feeling really hot. And uh, I feel like this may be involved or involving some kind of deception or somebody is not, they're hiding the truth, possibly. The truth has been hidden. Things have been going on the like in the darkness uh not in the daytime something's going on i don't know if this is related to business if this has to do with a relationship i feel like it is a battle and you are fighting to the bitter end and this if this uh I don't know if I've already said this. I'm sorry. I'm just kind of, my thoughts are just racing. I feel somebody racing around. I don't know if somebody is following somebody and they're trying, I feel like somebody is following somebody or trying to hide in the darkness. I don't know if this is making sense to somebody, but if it's not you, it's a relative or a close friend I feel like somebody is watching what somebody is doing. It could be in the workplace. It could be, um, and I feel, well, it, it could be, you know, at home. Um, but I feel like somebody is hiding, you know, or, the, and, and like maybe somebody has been through the ringer. Um, somebody is trying to like, Really, uh, I, I don't know. I just feel like somebody's trying to knock somebody down and, you know, the other person tries to get up and the other person's just very, I don't, controlling and uh, sneaky. I I don't know. These I these are the messages. They're kind of, It's kind of confusing me. So I just want to see what the reading, what comes out, because I'll be interested to see what that is. Um, okay, so this is for the sign of uh, Aquarius for April 2015. Um, we'll see if it can reveal some more, if any of this makes sense. Okay, it's wanting to pull there. Okay, let's take a look. Okay, we have the King of Cups in the upright position. The Four of Cups reverse. The Temperance reverse, the Temperance card. The Ten of Cups in the reverse position. And we have the Ten of Wands uh, in the upright position. Let's just see what this, uh, what the under, oh my gosh. I, when I was shuffling the cards, for some reason, I felt that the death card was going to come up. So we have uh, two major arcanas, the death card and temperance in reverse. Okay, I need a minute here to take this all in. Um, so just bear with me, please. Okay, so I want to start with one, a strong message that I'm getting is that this has to do with a home environment. This has to do, I believe, with either family, but I'm really leaning towards for the majority of you that this is uh, possibly going on and, and will 
be or will be happening possibly for you in April. I'm really feeling like this is some kind of a love uh, relationship. There, there is uh, a problem with. Um, I feel like, you know, this possibly could be a water sign. Um, a Pisces, Scorpio, or Cancer. We do have the King of Cups here. I, this is, I really am feeling strongly this has to do with a love relationship, family. I feel as if uh, somebody is very upset. They are very angry, um, almost childlike. I don't know if that makes sense. I feel like somebody's being very childish or child behavior. Uh, somebody is angry for not getting their way, and they are uh, in an uproar. And I feel like the other party needs to protect themselves. That's the messages that I'm getting. Um, this is kind of at the root of the matter. We have the Four of Cups. And um, I kind of feel in one sense that... You know, somebody, I'm getting the feeling like, you know, it's like a hide. Somebody needs to hide and possibly somebody else is, you know, trying to pursue somebody when they shouldn't be. Um, these are just, I, I feel like, um, I almost feel like the, the King of Cups in reverse. Um, I feel like things are very shaky. You know, they're very wavy, rocky. And I get the the um, feeling that um, in April there is going to be a, a letting go with the death card being the underlying theme. I really usually view this as a huge transformation. So it doesn't mean a literal death. It's a death of having to let go of something that possibly you thought was a certain way. Um, it's, but it's a transformation. So in order for something to transform, something has to go away in order for something to ignite or get renewed, um, to move forward, to move forward in a spiritual way. Um, you know, we, we have, um, I just, I feel like you need, somebody needs to shield themselves. They need to protect themselves. I'm really picking up on this armor here. Um, I feel that this has been possibly going on for a while. This is not something for the majority of you. I, you know, I'm just kind of seeing, you know, this, looking towards the sun. This has been uh, a long time coming and possibly the resolution will take place in April. Um, the challenge for you is uh, the temperance card. We do have it in reverse. I'm going to show it to you in the upright position. I'm being told that you need to take care of yourself uh, emotionally, um, mentally, find your balance, uh, because right now, this is in the upside-down position, okay? Um, I feel that I'm getting, I'm getting strongly shield. I don't, protection and shield. I, I, I don't know if this is making sense, uh, hopefully, um... You know, the, the messages are pretty strong here uh, with the Ten of Cups in reverse. What I'm think what I'm feeling is that this de definitely involves family. It could also involve children. And I, I get the sense and, you know, this is a, you, all your decisions of what needs to be done. I can only tell you the messages that I'm getting. I feel like this family... Possibly, if it's involving a family, it like I said, it could be a business. If this is not you, this may be a family member that you're seeing this happen to, brother or sister that this is happening to, male or female that this is happening to. I feel like it has something to do with the home. 
I feel that somebody needs protection um, and, you know, possibly saying goodbye to the home because it is in the in the reverse position. Um, you know, the, now just keep in mind, this is a general reading. So um, but and, and I can only let you know what I'm feeling and what messages I am receiving so this is uh this is what I'm getting in the you know and I feel like you know sometimes for me this this 10 of of wands here um I'm seeing as a shield protection protection from the home I also feel like uh there's a divorce or separation from the home going on uh, but I do feel like somebody is very angry. This may have uh, have involved an infidelity or or something secretive. It doesn't even have to be infidelity. It could be something secretive that was going on behind someone's back. Um, but I, you know, maybe somebody taking things away, taking things in a mental way, taking things uh, in a physical way, uh, you know, I kind of feel like maybe possibly, and uh, I'm not sure about this, um, but the message that I'm getting is possibly um, part of your family doesn't have your back or they don't see what you are seeing because things happen in the darkness like they're happening when maybe nobody else is around as a witness. Um, so, I, you know, what I'm guided to tell you is to, um, is to look for any kind of spiritual help, any kind of help that you feel or people support and get support um, from from loved ones or from anybody that you trust, or it could be spiritual support uh, from you know whatever your beliefs are um, in terms of that. But I just get the feeling that this is revolving around a relationship, uh, around a house, around family. Um, like somebody has been through a battle. I really feel like somebody has been like through a physical battle. Um, a passionate battle. Like they have fought for everything they could. And it's, you know, it's it's gotten to the point where I feel like, you know, it, it you're on guard to the point that um, you need to release, release mentally, release physically, um, talk to somebody. So um, these are, are the messages. I'm just, you know, I don't know. I'm just not, I, I, I just don't feel good. Um, I... I don't know whatever this is it's it's uh very strong i i just feel very um kind of like sick in my stomach um so i i hope this you know helps somebody out there um and um you know it's kind of a heavy reading i just wish that uh you know, but I just, I, I can only tell you what I feel and what I see. So um, these are the messages and um, that I'm um, here to share with you for April 2015. And um, like I said, get support, get get help. Um, if, if this even applies to you in any way, I, I hope it doesn't, to be quite honest. But... Um, um, but yet yeah, find support wherever you can and, you know, seek anything, any kind of professional help if that's needed. Um, but 
these are uh, the messages that I am getting, and I just need to be honest and share them with you, okay? All right. I'll talk to you very soon. Okay, bye.